All right, guys. I'm out here with a uh, Crick Digger Travis. What's happening? An ad from Relic Extractors. Doing some digging today out at this dump. We got a. Uh, this was Travis's hole last year. He had this like 10 feet deep, but you know, obviously it's not now. We're gonna. Our plan is to tackle this segment here next to it, push all that back, and get into a new section here. This this undug section up to that tree. So we're getting ready, trying to to prep it. We're gonna do some digging today, some digging tomorrow, and Maybe possibly the next day. Yeah, depending on how things go and. We're gonna get into some stuff. Yes, sir. So. Yeah. It's gonna get good for sure. Yeah. It's like a pulley system or wheel or something, I think. Check out what Shane just <laughs> popped out, guys. It looks like it has a handle. I thought maybe it was like a lamp it does holder look or something. Like that. Maybe that was to adjust the wick. Possibly. Like yeah. the amount of the flame would come up. Like that thing moves. Yeah, I don't and know. I you think... guys comment down below if you know what that is. I think this would have been There we go. Double filming, guys. <laughs> At its finest. Yeah. Let's see here. Oh, it just died, Shane. No, no, no. It's on. It is? Yep. Okay, it just, brother. It just turns the screen off is all. I don't feel any embossing on it. You know what? It might be a beer. It could be. The color made me think it was a jar. It could be a big beer. But I think it's... No. Oh. Oh, oh Eddie. <laughs> Eddie, you oh, suck. Oh, man. <laughs> He knows his dumb. Yeah, guys. Melons. Melons baby food jar. It totally looked like a midget jar. Yeah, I know. Now, it. if it was a cork top version. Kind of a medicine bottle. Right there, you can see it sticking out. Just gonna wiggle it out here. Ooh. Oh. Oh, it's aqua, too. That would have been it cool. It is. It's an aqua druggist, but slick. Blown <sighs> in mold. Nice inventory, though. Yep. Heck yeah, guys. Go keep working at it. See you back. Man, that would have been cool to be an aqua know. like I that too. I thought for sure I was going to be embossed. It's a nice earlier one. I was going to say good age. It's got the square lip too, so it's an older. I'd say you know, 1890s. Yeah. WT and Co. on the. Whitehall Tatum. Yeah. Check it out, guys. Shane's got some kind of a square bottle in the hole. Just working right down in that right gray ash layer. You can see oyster shells popping out. All right. kinds of glass in there, some kind of broken right beside it, little yeah. dish or streamer. Try to get around it here. Could even be a jar. It could be like a, I mean, a small one is usually embossed on the base. I don't think it's a small one, but. Oh, it could be like a tiny jar or something. I'm not sure. Yeah, it has a little tiny glass. I think it's bigger than a jar. Might be able to reach in there. And yeah, you should be able to wiggle around. Work around, around it. it. Peter Farney. It could be a Peter Farney. It looks, looks identical to that. I don't feel any embossing. It's machine made. It's got the Owens. It's still kind of. Yeah, I can get it. You got her. Oh, I was right. It is it's an embalming. embalming fluid. Yeah. Nice, Which brother. It? It's a. Uh, if it's a red falcon, it's rare. Dude. Eccles. Which one is it? Eccles. Eccles. They're, they're kind of hard to come by. I got one a little bit bigger than that. It looks like the Dodge with the cursive script. Look at that, guys. Shane just pulled out an Eccles embalming fluid. Yep. Nice, brother, I'm man. i the second one out of here. I got the other one. Yeah. Sweet. Sweet. All right, you're out. Cool. <laughs> All right, guys. <laughs> see you back. All right, guys. You can see down about five feet already. Just popped out a real nice bone-handled toothbrush with some cool designs on it. You can see there. Somewhere over there, uh, Shane is filming Eddie digging something, but I don't know exactly where they're at. And then here, I just popped out in the shovel. I just actually threw it out and saw it land behind me. Check that out. Real nice clay pipe bowl in the hole. All right, guys, Travis and I are working a hole over there. Ed's down in here. He just yelled over. He's got a got a really intact clay pipe down there and he's got a, a bottle showing yeah i don't know what it is yet could be a big olive oil could be you know something like a whiskey or something too i'm not uh, sure yet cool the top sticking out i got a bromo and a little sample wine there or whatever it is. oh it's embossed oh wow it's a nice. big one i never seen one this big S. Grover Graham, Dyspepsia Remedy, Newburgh, New York. Nice. It's about a half an hour or so from here. Cool. 
Pretty local then. Yep. Yeah, I was just looking at the smaller one I found here last year. Nice. Nice strong embossing on that too. Yeah. That sticks right out. I like finding the the larger meds. This is a plate right here. Ah, uh, yeah, I see it. Looks like it's almost intact. Mm, it's yeah, broke, in half, broken in half, yeah. The old shoe. Man, you were way in it here. That bottle's huge, whatever you got there. Yeah, it's got a, it looks like it's got a pattern around the neck, too. I can't. That thing is giant, oh, man. I think it's one of those barback bottles, which was, um, it was like a, a what they call a cordial bitters. Uh. That's what it looks like. Would it have etching on it? I it's, don't... it's got like a rib pattern around the neck. And I mean, there's no embossing on them, but the base has got like a monogram. Uh, some of them don't have the monogram on them, but then some of them do. Here we go. Here she oh, goes. he's got it. That's what it is. Look at oh, it. it's oh. got the label on it. Damn. Oh, man. It is the embossed version. Yeah, yeah. you're right. Yeah. I don't remember exactly what it says, but cool looking bottle. Yeah, cordial, cordial, something. Brandy. Yeah, yeah. Called it. That's yeah, cool bottle. Look at the. Looked like it had a something on the label there. Almost looked like an eagle wing or something there. You see that? Right on the. Oh yeah. Like a wing. Yep. Neat. So it looks like. Very cool. Yeah, Travis and I are getting down in it over there. Just gotta get a little deeper. Back over at Ed's spot here. I heard him say something. What you got? You got a nice big chemical. Oh, cool. What Yonkers is it? Roids, the Arlington Chemical Company, Yonkers, New York. Nice. That's cool. Arlington? Arli Arli Ar Arlington. Arlington, yeah, okay. Yep, like Arlington Cemetery. Nice. Yeah, Arlington Chemical Company, Yonkers, New York. Probably about 1880. Yeah? 1890. It's blown. Good throw. Yeah, you see that, guys? It's a, uh, what does that say? Oh, peptinoids. Yeah. Peptinoids. Yeah. So it's probably something similar to a bromo or something, you know? Yeah, yeah. But. Yonkers, New York. Cool. Look at cool. I've never seen one. See how feel heavy that is? It is, you know, it is for the size, yeah. Size Real thick. Yeah, here, I'm going to toss this up to you, too. All right. Oh. Try that again. There you go. Sweet. Yeah, you got a couple bottles here. He dug this Payne's, I think Travis filmed that. Payne celery compound there. A couple other little bottles there. I'm gonna get down in and film him pulling out this, this pitcher he's got. Yeah, a teapot. Or a teapot. It looks like it's got another pattern on it. It's got like a gold leafing on the spout. And then on this side, on the right hand side, it looks like a floral pattern. Oh, I see. So, I mean, like I said, the spout, look at the spout is perfect right there. You can see the very tip of it. Yeah. Yeah, hopefully the camera's picking that up. That's that's pretty nice looking, actually. Yeah, it looks like it's probably, looks almost like ironstone, like the crazing and the... Yeah, yeah. The yep. Well, this is going to be one of those gentle gentle works with the... Uh, I was thinking, hopefully it's stuck like that because the handle is there. Yeah, she's you know? moving. So I'm going to see, I think I can just pull it right out. Yeah, I saw it nudge. I'm thinking that handle is there, and that's why it is holding. Oh! Oh my God, she's full. Nice, dude. This thing is gorgeous. Nice. Yeah, it's nice. No, but I just had the lid. Right? It is iron stone. Yeah, look at that. Yeah. Nice. I've seen that pattern before. It's like a poppy plant or something. I think. Iron stone. Nolton. China. Uh, Knowles. Oh, Knowles. Yeah. Knowles and Taylor. Hmm. Wow. And it's got like an eagle in the middle of that. Yeah, in the middle of that insignia thing there. Man, killer. Yeah, I have a piece just with the same design on it. Yep. Really? Yep. Ah, sick. Rosebuds. Hell yeah, dude. That's only on one, is it only on one side? Oh, no. Yeah, oh. probably has something on the other. Yeah. Let's see, let me wipe it off a little bit. Here. I'll be kind of gentle with it. Yeah, it's on there. I can see the red. Nice. Heck well, you yeah, know dude. who's going to be claiming this one? <laughs> Chef Annie. <laughs> Chef Annie. Sweet. Dude, maybe the lid's in there, too. Yeah, it might be stuck up in the ceiling, yeah. right? Because it was just sitting there like that. Yeah, definitely keep an eye out for it, for sure. 
Absolutely. Awesome, dude. Well, that's my find of the night, even over the other stuff. Hell yeah. That's awesome. I love finding stoneware and stuff like that. That's like, I mean, you heard Andy, I think Andy told you when you got there, I'm, I'm, I'm big on the stoneware. So funny. These 1910 jelly jars here. Mm. Yeah, I mean, this. Some of them were peanut butter, too. I've dug a couple that were beets, not peanut butter. They had like a label on them. There's some a type of tin lid. Some product jar lid, yeah. Looks like a. Hires, maybe? Or... Yeah. Oh, no. oh, what is that? Stove, Stove enamel. Or, yeah, yeah. Parlor Pride <laughs> from Boston. <laughs> I'll let you have that because you go from Parlor City. You yeah. Can have it. It's one for you. It's clogged pretty good. There's a lot of junk <laughs> in there. Parlor for the Parlor City Pickers and Dickers. Parlor Pride Stove Enamel. Millican and Company, Boston. Cool. That's for you. Yeah, that's for you. Thanks, brother. Let's see what else we can get out of here. Oh, you can. Oh, dude, is that Atlanta, Georgia? Yeah. Oh, shit. Yep. Careful here. All right, hopefully that's all that wants to go. Oh, salesman. No, it's something else. Is that intact there? To the to the left, right where the cave in was, all the way to the left. See that sticking out? Yep, there we go. What's that? Doctor Fletch. Nope, Doctor. Ketchums? Ketchums? Deckums. Det. D e t c h o n s. Huh. Doctor Detchens. Maybe Detchens. Yeah, Detchens. Relief for rheumatism. Nice. That's something new. I don't think I've ever seen one of those. Nice square lip. Yep, Dr. Retchen's relief for rheumatism. Nice. Yeah, yeah, I see that. Or a It's cool to get an early milk. Yeah, well, I mean, you know, it's... It's hard to... Sometimes in this dump, too, I mean, it's in certain spots. I mean, sometimes it's all your big in milk. Yeah. Yeah, it's definitely a beer or soda or something. Ketchup. Catch up about <laughs> that top, right? Yeah. You almost get killed for a ketchup. <laughs> oh man. Yeah, I mean I was I'm not I'm really I haven't been messing around too deep in there. It's yeah. Just, you know. No, this isn't this too is that, See this black line right here? Yeah. That's, that's like a That's actually what gave way. So that, weird. Actually, like gunpowder. <laughs> it's like, yeah, look, it's like, seriously, look, it's like, like millings. Coal or something, yeah. Powdered coal. Guys, me and Shane's taking turns at this point pulling buckets. We're about eight feet now. And check out what I just popped out. Look at that. R. H. Macy and Company, New York, with a nice star on it. Sweet blown in mold cork top bottle. Yes, sir. That's a nice one. Yeah. Probably 1890s to about 1905 on that one. And, uh, yeah, just going to keep working at it. We probably got maybe an hour left of light, and then we'll be back out here first thing in the morning to continue. But that's a cool little find. See you back. All right, guys, up here at the top of the hole, and you can see down in there, Shane has a, what he says is a Dr. Kennedy's. Yeah. In the hole right there. Yeah, it's got, it's got an early looking lip to it. There she is. Favorite remedy. Dr. Cam Kennedy's favorite remedy. Out of Kingston, New York. It's got a... It's not hinge mold, but it's early. It's probably 1890s. Yeah, absolutely. 1890s. Yep. Sweet, brother, cool. man. Yeah, Stay man. live for just a second, guys, and then that's going to be it for tonight. Yeah, there might be something, something else in there that's... It's definitely in the trash layer. We've sure. been busting through. This is the third cap we came to. We're about the 10 foot mark right now. So not bad for about three and a half, four hours of digging. No, no. We bust the tail on it. Got a good start for tomorrow. Ooh. You got something? Oh, it's broken. It's a oh. it's a piece of decorated stoneware. Oh man. It's like a bowl or something. It's or... broke. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. But I might be able to get it out here. 
Man, I'm in the glass here now. There's oh, another yeah. bottle there. Is it? Oh, what's this? What is it? What is what it? What is it? <laughs> it's a... Uh, Oh, it's funny. It's funny. It's Dr. Pierce's. Dr. Pierce's? Golden Medical Golden Discovery. Medical Discovery. That's what I thought the, the Kennedys was. The Kennedys right? and the Dr. Pierce's. Shane is in the embossed bottles, guys. Two big meds, back to back. Yeah, this was the, it was a decorative oh, bowl. With yeah, that would have been real pretty. Not quite sponge wear, but like similar. All right, guys. Well, we are going to call it a night. We're going to mess around a little bit longer, but... We'll see you back bright and early in the morning. Yep. All right, guys, we're going to get started, and everybody's going to get started on their spots. Shane's walking around trying to grab some quick surface finds real quick. Look at all of it, though. I mean, it's like a beach of bottles. Stuff all over the place. Looks like you're on a beach of bottles, brother. <laughs> we get a picture of that. <laughs> all right, guys, we'll see you back. All right, guys, we're back out here today back with travis at this hole we've been going at i got down in there and you didn't even pull that crop shane oh i know that's what i'm about to do oh okay <laughs> all right heck yeah we bro. got a i got a crock showing down there a uh cylinder whiskey and, and a square bottle so we're gonna try to pull them live here for you guys i'm gonna hop down in and i think they're ready to ready to come on out might be able to pull it all right, guys. Let's see. Let's see what we got here. It's not quite. Not quite. It's right in that rust. That rust is solid. Yeah. True. I think it's real close though. Yeah. I did too. I don't wanna yeah. pry it too much I'd here. Use, I'd use your, uh, little hand I don't know if I'd be able to reach it. Got a extract. Oh, little root beer extract there. Where did I put that little hand tool? Is it up there? Yeah. Yeah, I might be able to get around the other side with this. Here, guys, it's a yep, root beer extract, Bryant's. Oh, Bryant. Bryant. Nice, uh, man, that's the harder one. I was going to say, it's tougher than the... Much tougher than the higher. Than the higher. Is that amber? Yep. Dang, that's a nice one right there. Heck yeah. yeah. It's like glued to that rust. <laughs> There we go. Here it comes, guys. Got it. See what we got. Uh. Anything on it? It is out. Oh, that's got to have a stamp on it. Uh, I think it's just a just a blank salt glazed cheese crock. But either way. Cheese or cake crock? Yep. That's a nice thing. Sweet. Oh, it's intact. Yes, She's yeah, intact. Ten feet down for the shame. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> it was intact. Oh my god. Well, she was intact. Now I'm happy it didn't have anything on. I think there was a hairline there that must have just just let itself. Let itself go. That's all right. We do have a bottle. We got a cylinder whiskey in there. I'm going to try to show you guys. And honestly, probably another bottle or two because it's kind of loaded right there. So we'll see. See what we can up pull live here. Oh, oh the whiskey's uh, broken right down the, the middle there. Well, that's a bummer. That was a uh, little anticlimactic there. Oh well. We're getting into the trash though, guys. So Travis is about to hop in here and get his side. We're gonna keep keep going deeper and 
cleaning her out this is a deep dump we're probably about i don't know almost 10 feet here where i'm at so keep going and get back with you when we get some more stuff out here at the spot travis is down in the hole and he just pulled out this weird thing it's like a it's like a black bakelite material uh it's got like a weird threaded knob on the one end there and it's actually it's actually debossed it says the century pet in october 25th 1898 and then on the other side it says the sh wetmore co new york i'll try to rub it off a little bit to give you guys a a better look but <clears throat> that's pretty cool i don't know what it would be i've seen similar things that were like nasal douches and stuff like that or uh i think there's a dr kilmer one that was a like a uterine injection tool or something see if you could see that there century This is all I was doing before over there, and the whole wall just uh, kind of chipping at it. Oh, look, it's got the cap. Oh, it's kind of different, yeah. That's cool. Cap with the rubber still intact and everything. Yeah. Cool. That's the first time I dug one like that. It's even got I've, a little bit of a label on it, too. Yeah, it's taller than like ones I've seen, too, slightly. Yeah, yeah. Right? I mean, yeah, the neck's a little higher. Yeah. Weird. Maybe it's embossed. I don't know. Not, not there. Not in the base either, but I think it says Sanford's on it. I it's really got can't a label say it. on it, yeah. My eyes ain't that good for that. Uh, is that Sanford? Yeah, it's hard to tell. I can't. I see like an A or an S and an A. Or... It looks like an A and like a. Is that machine made? I don't know. I, I don't know. I don't think so. It might be. It's a little dirty around the cap. Yeah, it's machine. That's a nice one though. Yeah, yeah it's a really machine. Cool, dude. Good fun. Relic extractors, extract yeah. the goodies. <laughs> Extracting them. And uh, we're about the 11 foot mark. This is day number two. Me and Shane's been tag teaming the hole for a while. Hopefully you guys can see everything clear. We haven't gone live for quite some time, but uh, I've got bottles everywhere. So I'm just gonna, you know, start pulling them and see what we can get. We're getting down in here. There's a really cool, massive bottle right here. I'm gonna go ahead and pull. Look at that big dog. Big court eye grandson. Is it a blob or a crown? It's a crown, blown in mold crown top. Nice. Look at that, guys. That's the first one out. Heck yeah. All right. That's cool. The Isaac Cran's crown. This big dog right here just fell out. Big old champagne bottle. Big kick up on that. Yaz Jimbo on the board. Look at this. Coca-Cola, straight side Coca-Cola. Where's that from? New York. City. New York City? Yeah. Dang, that's awesome, brother. Congratulations on that. That's a sweet find. Heck yeah, what else do you got? Rosewood. Rosewood Dandruff Cure. Prepared by R. Reeves Company out of doesn't say. Yeah, it does. Anderson? Anderson, oh, Indiana. Anderson, Indiana. Nice, brother. Oh, that's a big pipe bowl. Dude, you are into it, man. That is neat as can be. I like that. That's cool. Heck yeah, Jimbo. Killing it. Kyle just got here. Welcome, brother, man. Nice to meet you. He's going to be over digging with Eddie. What do you got? What'd you pull? Oh, look at that. New York safety lamp. Oh, that's awesome, Steve. It's got a chip. It was, it was, look at y'all boys. It was like stuck in iron, but uh, yeah, it's a cool little safety. I will give props to these fellas, guys, yeah. because I invited them to come dig in our hole with us, and every one of these guys is, is doing their own thing. <laughs> that's awesome, yeah, man. Yeah, it's that's a cool real cool little... find, Steve. Heck yeah, brother. Keep at it. Right, so, uh, Check it out, guys. I got a really nice staircase working going down into ours. We got some braces put up. Shane stood down in the hole pulling some stuff. Yeah. Bunch of slicks coming out. You got something? I think that Steve's got something over here. What do you got? I think it's a chamber pot. Chamber pot? Yeah, I think so. Let's see if I can 
work my way down and get it on film here. Try not to. No, that's all right. Don't worry. get a Quick. bunch of it in there. I don't know if you could. It's in that corner. Here, uh, I, think I think there's a handle on it too. Oh yeah, that's huge. Yeah. <laughs> it's giant. <laughs> Isn't that giant? So I think, I think, I think that's a handle. I don't know what that is. But I don't even know if it's home. Yeah, it definitely looks like it. At least so far. Let's see what it is. And all that other stuff is right here. Wow. So it's like they. You're in it. Yeah, I do see that thing on the side. It looks like some sort of yeah. I don't know what the hell sort of is. handle. This thing is massive. <laughs> I just hope it's whole. I don't know if it is. I don't know what the hell. Almost looks like a giant like wash. I don't know. Face it, it. it might be. Well, here it comes. I don't know what it is. Oh my god! It's the bottom blown out. Might be bottom flown out. Ah, uh, is it? Yep. That's why. Why? Ah, uh, bummer. What is going on there, though? What is that, dude? I think that might be like a, like a, sink bowl. Yeah. What is? I think it's maybe a sink bowl. Yeah, it sure. It sure feel. You know, it's like that uh, porcelain or something. Yeah. Could even have a stamp somewhere on it. So I've seen similar things. It's just weird. Oh, that would have been cool. Would that be like an overflow or something if they were? Right, that's what I was I like. Know. What does that look like? I don't know. I have no idea, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, because there's drainage holes. Yeah. There's drainage holes there. Yeah. Yeah, I think it's like maybe a sink or something. Or a urinal. <laughs> Could be a urinal. Yeah. That's cool either way. The socks is broken because yeah. it's pretty neat. That is pretty neat. Damn. <laughs> well, something better come out of here, hole. Show him that. Yeah, guys, he was showing me a couple early pieces he pulled. This was a really nice ink there. Pour spout. Pour spout ink. Crude applied top. Just got a little chip on the back. Was sitting on oh, it. that's the thing earlier. Yeah. yeah, safety lamp. Dude, that is cool. Isn't that cool? Hell yeah, that's wicked cool. I've never seen one of those. Yeah, I don't know if it's like a kid's, you know, a little kid's light, uh, night light or something. Uh. But, yeah. Oh, this ugly dude. Uh. I don't know what he is. Dude, that's actually cool, yeah. Could be like maybe a match holder or something. Yeah. <laughs> Cut glass inks. Uh. Yep. The Valentine's. The meat juice. Yeah, the meat juice. That was wicked cool. Dude, I, th I think this is a match holder. I don't, I don't think, think that so? hole would have originally been there. Huh. I think, uh, yeah, I think that's a match holder. Wow, that's pretty cool. Yep. That'd go with the oddities stuff. Yeah, I like finding stuff yeah. like that. I like finding stuff like that just as much as good bottles. Yeah, yeah no doubt. It, it is fun. And I'll show you as he pulls them. Yes, sir. We got Travis live, live streaming here from yeah. Crick Diggers. Ed and Jimbo. Ed from... Uh, Relic extractors up there, and I got some stuff showing here. I've been cleaning out this hole for for quite a bit. I got a what looks to be a bitter quell, and uh, it's got a couple bottles around it, pretty tightly packed. It's got a soda there. Looks like some sort of medicine right below it. So I got to be kind of kind of careful with how. Oh, there's another another medicine in there. I've been digging deep and getting in this heavy rust here but but not much you know not much glass not many bottles have come out but it looks like right up in this layer it's more more trashy and there's there seems to be a lot of stuff there so we're gonna pull it for you guys and see what we got here yeah it's tight in there all right there we go here's a nice olive green color bitter quill yeah, there pretty man yeah bitter quill guys you got see the soda there looks like actually another soda here jimbo over there just uh earlier pulled a straight side coke 
over in his hole. So that'd be awesome to get something, you know, get one of those. Oh yeah, we got a, we got quite a lot of bottles here, guys. Yeah, they're popping. There's a there's a druggist. Oh, it is embossed. Oh, an embossed druggist in the hole. It's uh, oh, Tuttles, right? Tuttles. That's yeah, Tuttles, yeah. Tuttles, yep. Nice. Yeah, yeah. Tuttles. Cool. That's, that's local. Yeah, that's a Middletown druggist there, guys. Neat. Looks like uh, man, this is this is a loaded pocket, guys. There's a bottle there, bottom of a bottle here, top of a bottle there. And I still got these. I'm working over here. And right there, there's like probably seven showing right now. What the hell is that? Ah, oh, that was a bottom to a Saddles. We got a fancy little deco salt shaker. Little shaker bottle. Little shaker. Trying to show both you guys and the the viewers for Travis right now because we're live streaming so we'll show them in real time maybe this is another druggist here oh yeah nice sweet that's the uh another size of the Ogden and uh Ogden and Shimmer. yeah yep awesome, I think I I found one of these earlier guys a surface find over there uh but I think this is a different size so that's, that's cool sweet one man sweet nice pull, Shane. heck yeah I'll take embossed druggists all day. I love pharmacy bottles. Pharmacy bottles, some of my favorite to dig. What do we got here? Oh, the ketchup. There you go, Steve. <laughs> <Got> your bottle. <laughs> <laughs> you guys can have that one. <laughs> oh, man. And all the ketchup. Oh, yeah. All right, guys, we're going to see see what we got here. Ah, oh, this is unfortunately broken. Uh, I could tell it was could tell it was busted. Soda? Yeah, it's a it's like unembossed. Oh, it's a slick slug plate. It could have been not not even a slug plate. Yeah, it might have been shoulder embossed. Oh, it probably was a comb. Ah, uh, I see it had some sort of embossing way at the top there. Yeah, shoulder shoulder embossed something or another but we got we got another soda here that looks to be intact so we're gonna keep working this pocket guys and keep digging live here because they're finally popping i guess i was in the wrong layer i was too deep <laughs> i'm sure there's no Nah, I know. <laughs> I know. Just happen to be not producing, you know. Yeah, you want it right now? Yeah. All right, guys. Well, that was busted. That was a that was a quart soda broken, unfortunately. Yeah, it might have been. I've dug one Sweeney, but it had cracks in it. You want me to put them in the bucket? Or yeah, you... just set them in the bucket and I'll put them in the bucket. Alright. Show everybody. Alright, should be, should be good to go. Here yeah. comes the bucket of goodies. Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, man. What else do we have here? Seem to be seem to be right in them. I'm going to see what we got. This is a tool that, that Travis made. Works really well for for getting right around them when they're in, you know, when they're in tight spots. Sometimes you want to use something that can get right right in them. I like this little hand tool he's got here. What's that? Oh, is it busted? Ah, oh, man, they're so tightly packed. That's why a lot of it, a lot of it's broken. They're just so tight in here. Man, it's a shame. There's the bottom of a, bottom of a medicine showing there, guys. That might be intact. And, nope. 
Looks like that one was unembossed anyways. That's good. Makes you feel better when they're broken and they're not embossed anyways, so can't really cry over that. You got a big uh big product jar with a 1903 patent date. Drug is coming out of the hole. What else are we gonna pull here for you guys? It's definitely still coming out. Kind of just following, following that layer. Doing what I can to keep on keeping on. You got a milk glass, uh, just cosmetic type, type jar there. Milk glass. There's that thing. It's like a like a tile or something there. Yeah, a little tile. Some sort of to fall down the hill now, isn't it? sort of glazed tile. You can see I'm I'm deep in here. We're we're tunneling pretty good, but but we've got this middle support going. Travis's hole is over on this side. We've just been taking turns, working back and forth, pulling buckets for each other and. I'm getting in them. Uh, my hole wasn't producing much for a bit there. And then I decided to dig a little a little higher up in this layer and it's definitely definitely been more stuff popping out of here. Just so tightly packed is all. Seems like a lot of it unfortunately just got crushed. Which is a super bummer. Well, we're gonna we're gonna see maybe what else we can pull on a live dig for you and we got a uh oh, is it a that was a grand union or something it says tea company i thought it was one of the yeah it's grand union tea company grand union tea company. <clears throat> i thought it was one of those dirky yeah, bottles bottle. looks like the dirkies like i forget i forget what they are yeah, I know what you're talking about. er dirky or something something like that yeah Tea extract. I got a couple. Ah uh... oh, man. What's up? Relic extractor. Yo, brother, how you doing? <laughs> you got people commenting on the live feed up there, watching me from a different angle. You got one of those cool stack donut looking. Yeah, a little mustard container. Yeah. Man, guys, it is absolutely packed in here. It's just a shame that it's so tight. As I could tell, just so much of this just got crushed because of, because of you know, what's on top. There's a bottom to a to a soda there. Good. It's just top, yeah, I just want to make sure I was in there pretty good. Yeah, I'm watching. You got no cracks up, up here at all. Sweet. Yeah, I was getting I was getting pretty far. It's the same thing that happened on my side too, but it stopped right yeah. there. Yeah. I was getting getting pretty far in there. Uh, what do we got guys? It is on <laughs> It's uh, dude, you know what? It's like an aqua, like mineral water looking lip on oh, it. Look on the bottom, is that a Pluto? <sighs> no, that's what I thought too. It's not a Pluto. Man, I got it ripped off. It's made by Root. Okay. The bot. If I saw that bottom, I would have thought that was a straight side Coke. It looks like a Coke. Make sure it ain't super faint. Because <sighs> that that uh, PB Hartford that I found up here, that straight side Coke from Goshen, that had real light strike on it. So. Did it? Yeah. If you look at the lip, it's not a crown top. Oh. It's like a weird, like, yeah. you find like the super light green mineral waters with this style. Toss that up here. Is it a blob? <sighs> I guess you'd call, I guess you'd call it a blob, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I'll tell you what it is. Oh, oh, oh. It didn't work. my fault. It's not a best, not the best throw. That wasn't either, but you got it. <laughs> got that time, guys. Oh, you know what that could be? I mean, usually they were they the olive and black glass, like an Apollinaris, like a table water. Yeah, that's what, yeah. Mineral water, yeah. Mineral water, yeah. 
Root glass. Well, I've never seen a root glass with a, with a, with a blob pop like that on it. Yeah. I'm kind of glad I didn't see the base was embossed root because I would have been real excited for a real big disappointment. <laughs> kind of makes me happy I didn't even see. Yeah, yeah it is. I got something else in there, but it looks like it's, uh, looks green. Like it's probably a champagne or something. I'm going to try to get a couple more out and maybe Travis could hop back in if he wants and start working his hole over there. He's been Today is Saturday the 14th. Yep. going hard. It does kind of look like a Pluto water, John. You're right. But from root glass, that's kind of strange. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah. John says root glass, 1906 to 1931. Hmm. Well, that's got to be close to when they start. That's an earlier one. Yeah. Yeah. I, I put that right in between 1906 and 1910. Yeah. Definitely agree. Alright guys, I am beginning to take the top down. We have reached the bottom. About 13 feet. And uh, right here, up in this upper layer you can see i got glass hanging out i got a, a jar i think right here there it dropped there it is oh the bottom's knocked out of there oh what was it oh white crown hmm. white crown mason it says the bottom knocked out of it shoot dag nab it i see that you guys check that out right there horse in the hole I think this is the tail piece of it. It might be even be like a like a cup or something. I can't tell. There's the other leg on it. What just happened? Uh, ew. Oh my gosh, look at that. Dude, that's awesome. Whoa guys. <laughs> it's a cow with, with horns and stuff. That's and a oh. sailboat embossed on it. Look at that. It's a, it's like a flower pot. It's got a handle for the tail. It's missing one leg. Oh, that is incredible. Look at that, guys. Check that bad boy out. That is sweet. Check that out. <laughs> See you back. Guys, Travis is down in his hole, and uh, we're starting to attack the walls. He just got a, a wicked cool, like, porcelain cow. With, <laughs> that thing's like, sick, man. Heavily decorated. It's got, a, like, a little reservoir on the top there. Hey, you can, you can hold on that to it. Looks it's, it's, you got, like, udders. Man, that thing is awesome, <laughs> dude. Uh, that is bad. That I is wicked it. cool. That's real neat. Heck, yeah. That's got to be, like... I wonder if it's like a little gravy boat or something. Dude, I bet it is. You know? You know what? I think the mouth's hollow where you pour it out of the Dude, mouth. Dude, no way. <laughs> Sick. Yeah. Wicked cool. Isn't that neat? Dude, I think you're right. It's plugged up, but I, I, I think, think you're, you're right. A gravy yeah. boat, man. And that tail's like that because it's a handle. It's a handle. Dude, that is sick. <laughs> That, wild? that is wicked cool. Guys, Travis, uh, I think he filmed that live on his. I did. I got it live. Yep. I'll show it to you. So you guys, you know, you guys can watch the video over on Crick Diggers. We're going to both make our own videos. Um, so I think Ed over here yelled that he had something too. We're going to go see what he's got. Bring you guys over to his hole and see what he was yelling about. What do you got in there, Ed? Yeah. All look right. at look at this thing. That's what Travis got. That's cool as hell, man. Dude, it's a gravy boat. Is that what it is? And the, it it's comes out of its mouth. No kidding. Yeah. All what right, so we have a a T Cohallen blob top, Middletown, New York. Nice. It's very hard to find. Very hard to find. This is only the second one that I know of. Nice. Um then we got Isaac Crans, like Travis dug earlier. Yeah, yeah um, I found I one of those too. I don't see any damage on it. Um, check this out. Oh, it's the whole jawbone. 
of what I do not know. Huh. What the? <laughs> I don't know if maybe it was like a boar. Like, like a, a wild, wild boar or something? Yeah. Up. That's what I was thinking. Look at that tooth, man. That tooth will make a cool necklace. <laughs> you know hold, I mean? hold it hold it out a little bit. I could probably get it, but you guys see that? He's got like a like a fang for a wild boar. Yeah, the bought part of the jawbone. You can see where it was cut. And there's one, two, three, four molars and that big giant incisor right there. Wow. I'll just pull that incisor off, then you can see how big that thing really is. Yeah, that's awesome. Yeah, that thing's huge. <laughs> I see that thing sticking out. I'm like, don't tell me. What am I got here? I've already dug a human skull in this place. Now what do I got, right? <laughs> and then I got this stoneware. I'm going to piece it back together. It's very fragile, but I got all the pieces, dude. Oh, nice. Except for the oh, ginger beer. Yep, big old, big and stoneware well, it could beer. Could be lemon beer too. They had lemon beer. Yeah, yep. Is yep. it the bo is it uh, stamped on the shoulder? No, I was looking for. Really? I was looking to see if it was a knickerbocker because we pulled some knickerbockers out of here. Before. Nice. So, and cool, depending dude. on which knickerbocker it is, it's you can have a pretty good price tag on it. Nice. Um, then I got this really nice A. L. Murdoch panel liquid food. Oh, that's cool. Paneled amber uh, medicine or something. Both in USA and London. Well, a quarter percent soluble albumin. So it's like albuminized food. Like huh. a, almost like a baby food, like a powdered milk kind of thing. Probably I tastes guess. great. Oh, I bet. Put that <laughs> in your morning coffee. Right? That's sick. So I saw the panel and I was like, oh, that's cool. And then, um, move my phone out of the way. I almost had Chef Annie another teapot. Almost. Uh. Missing the handle and the spigot. Nice Japanese. Oh, yeah. Motif on it there. Yeah, real ornate. And I've seen the same pattern on teacups in here. I've broke, you know, like, like 100 feet away from here. Yeah. You know what I mean? So it makes you wonder how stuff gets scattered. Yeah, yeah. Um, true. Big slick med. Broken pane celery compound top. Mm. Little ponds extracts. Cool. Keys B and Madison, cornflower blue. Ah, uh, yeah, those are cool. Like a promo style. Yeah, I like those. And then uh, I, I got a piece of it, one of these yesterday. Remember it had like the house pattern on it? Yeah. Right? It was just like the top and a piece of that triangle on the panel. It's, it's got the indented panel like the Kilmers do. It's like a female remedy. But it says Calcura. Okay. The top of it looks just like a female remedy. You know? It's like that got that cathedral point, like sucking panel. Yeah. Cool, yeah, dude. both sides. Actually, all four sides are they're like that. They're sucking. Sure. Yeah. Yeah. Says Calcura solvent. Very so, nice. I mean, it could be a chemical, but it's got that double collar top on it, which is really nice. Reminds me of like the uh, like the Dr. Miles. Yeah, yeah, same Medicine style. Secure. Same style look. And then I got this nice uh, Condal Agua de Rubina, Spanish mineral water. Huh. I've done a, dug a few of these out of here before. So and they're in Boss? Wow. Yeah, it's in Boss right here. Huh. And uh, yeah, it's, it's like a Spanish mineral water, I guess, something like that. Cool, dude. So this is like the third or fourth one. Gonna go try to see what I can pull out before we head out of here. We're all exhausted and running on a low amount of sleep, but gonna go see what I can find and I'll get back with you guys. Check it out, guys. Mason jar in the hole right there. Let's get it. Somebody's hollering over there. Oh, it's one of them white crowns. Oh, are you kidding me? It's broken the same Look at that. Way. 
Oh, it makes me sickening. White crown mason, bottom knocked out. Every one of them. That's way too weird. See back. Guys, we think we got an embossed bottle in the hole right here. Looks like Shane says he thinks he can feel embossing on it. Yeah, I think so. Looks like an embossed pharmacy. Let's see what it is. Oh, oh. Oh, oh my god! god. <laughs> trying to take it away. Right from... at it. Oh, it's another one of the uh yeah, the what is it? Something in Turhoon. Tuttle and Tuttle and Turhoon. Tuttle, 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 yep. Nice. Yep. Another Middletown druggist. Cool. Sweet. Another variant for you. Awesome. Nice brother. Heck yeah. You yeah. glad it didn't get broken yet. <laughs> Guys, we're popping out bottles here and there. Nothing crazy really, but I just popped this amber one out. Look at that. It's crazy look at that yes sir that is awesome yeah. it says jw peters if it's got the bird dog on it it's not it's something different hold this for me for a minute Shane, it, if you I mean, it's got the horse on it yeah it's it, yeah it's got something crazy it's the on horse it. on it it's the horse yeah hunter pulled one out of andy's wall here a couple months back. it says it's your it's your <laughs> Battist, Batista. Wow. Batista. Batista. It says Pharmacia Inglés del Servo Napoli. Napoli. That's sick. That's yeah, weird. isn't that cool? cool? Check that out, guys. Dang, that's neat. That just came out, just fell out of the ceiling right there. That's sick. Very, very cool. Yeah, it's got like a deer or something on it. You it's can see the antlers. Of course, I think. Yeah. Oh, it's got antlers. Oh, yeah, you can see the antlers coming back on it. Huh. It could be a horse, but it's got antlers. Killer, dude. And I don't Maybe know what that's supposed corn. to be. Where it's is it jumping over something or? It's stepping over it anyway. Yeah, quite so. Maybe somebody's head. Huh? I think it's a veterinary bottle. Is it a vet bottle? That so. makes sense. Wow. Ooh, that's really cool. I like that. Hell yeah. Yes, sir. Guys, Shane has some kind of strange looking bottle in the hole right there. Check that out. Big old mouth on that thing. Okay. I'm thinking it's a sauce, but I don't, I don't know. Let's get it live action. Oh, there's no amber <laughs> yeah, there ain't no mad guy. Look, there's another ball right beside it. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. Poison? That might be the same thing. Eh? No, that's a little guy. Nah, you probably got a better view than I do of it. Yeah, get that out of there. That might be a poison too. Is it bigger? Yeah, I think it's a, it oh, a, I thought a pharmacy. I thought it was like a little square. I think it's, oh, it is longer, isn't it? Like a whiskey or something. Is it blob? No, no, it's not a blob. It is like maybe a whiskey sort of style lip on it. Yeah, I think it's a whiskey. Yeah. You got your other scratching tool there, Chad? That little extractor. Right here, floating around. Get right up on it with that thing. Yeah, that ain't no freaking olive oil. Let's see what we got here, guys. Big whiskey. Yeah. Oh, yeah, beautiful big, lady's leg. Big cylinder. Look at uh, this big mouth on that thing. Really nice aqua. Yeah. Oh, nice. it is a boss. Too. Is it? Yeah. Oh, man. Heck yeah. The, uh, what does that say? Sir Robert Burnett Co. Robert Burnett. Old Tom Cincinnati. Robert Burnett whiskey. No, it's actually a gin. Is it a gin? Old Tom Cincinnati. Yep, that's, or uh, old time gin. I thought I said sin. That's the. Uh, I'm sorry, Kyle. I thought I said gin uh, or sin. That is a different variant. I've got the other ones that are very ornately embossed. Huh. It's still the same. It's still <laughs> that's a sweet freaking cylinder gin, man. Cool. Heck yeah. yeah. You still that? You don't want that olive oil, do you? <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was an olive oil. Well, there's another one back in there. There's something else there. Let's see what we can. Oh, that's gross. See, is it? You sure? No, not that big one. Uh, what is that? Barclay? I don't know. Huh? L. L. Barclay? It's like, oh, yeah. Is it embossed? Uh, 
Yeah, it is. Oh, oh my, that's my wife's my wa- There you go. Yeah. Send that to your woman. <laughs> She might yeah, give you an extra day of digging. Yeah. All right, guys, we're going to keep at it. That's a cool gin, man. Yeah, yeah, heck yeah, that's cool. I've never dug one. Okay, yeah, I've dug the, the square ones, like the like the um, the Gordons. Yeah, yeah. Exactly like the Gordons that say Sir Robert Burnett yeah. dry gin, but I ain't never seen the cylinder one variant. That's cool. Cool, heck yeah. See you back, guys. Guys, check it out. We're going tunneling. Tunnel with the, time. With the Shane Porter. Oh yeah. Way back in here. I haven't felt if it's uh, got embossing on it yet, but it's got the flat panel on the bottom, so uh-huh. it's probably a good likelihood it is embossed. Knock on, knock on wood. We'll find out together with you guys. I think I could just maybe pull yeah, it. Yeah, you can. I don't know if I could grab it. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh, we got another pharmacy. See what it is. I think it might be one of the ones I dug earlier. Maybe not the same size. Yeah, it's another one of the Tuttle and Turkey. Tuttle, yeah, yeah. Nice, brother. You are on the embossed pharmacy. Cool. Another Shane pharmacy yeah. bottle. Maybe now I can give uh, Kyle the one that I already said I was gonna <laughs> give him. <laughs> See you back, guys. Go,